Hey guys, it's San Monani and welcome to Alien Defense Entertainment. If you're new to this channel, thank you so much for coming through and to those that has been with me since the start and those that has just recently joined us, thank you so much for your love and support. I really value each and every one of you. Gantanda. So Mizi issued a statement on his social media account, namely Instagram, in addressing the, um, uh, the abuse allegations made by Mohale to him. And he said this, Dear all, never in my wildest dreams did I think that I would one day have to defend my honor as a result of someone I have loved so deeply and so genuinely, deliberately harming a reputation I've worked so hard to build for most people for most the part of my life i've kept my relationship out of the public eye until my one and only marriage which you witnessed on television and other media it took me this long to arrive at to arrive at a stage where i could make the conscious decision to share my life traditionally and lawfully with someone and that should explain the level of depth of my love for that person and community Commitment to the person. It is incredibly painful that what I thought would be a beautiful new normal for the rest of my life with the love of my life is no longer what it will happen. I have loved loudly and proudly and as such you all have experienced a part of our relationship by virtue of my reality show, our wedding special on TV and our social media platforms. Now you are also an audience to what has sadly become a breakup between two people laced by defamation, false but very serious allegations and interference from supposedly close and reliable sources in the spread of information some some true and some are false the facts of the matter that i am comfortable to share are the following our relationship had its ups and downs and uh, but i have never been physically or knowingly emotionally abusive towards my estranged husband i vehemently deny the allegations of criminal acts towards him and would like to clear my name of that defamation what i am going to state however is that we had one altercation and we which I had to defend myself and both of us were physically hurt by the other. I am at this age not at liberty to dive deeper into the details but can state that he is not a victim of this situation. I have been accused of sabotaging his efforts to be financially independent and confirm that I have never made a concerned effort to block his opportunities. In fact, I have encouraged it. I have even through my own channels petitioned to opportunities for him to make money through my uh, networks and I've amplified some of the works he's done through his campaigns. There have been uh, publications of stories related to our sex life and a lot of what has been said is absolutely untrue. These are very personal and private matters and I wouldn't I would like to keep it as such. What is incredibly painful is that a person whose income is reliant on uh, their reputation and public image, this campaign to smear my reputation has the potential to result in loss of income. I have already had to take leave from my places of employment in order to focus on his on this process. Rather, this wouldn't have had to happen if I wasn't being accused of things I didn't do. In as far as divorce itself is concerned, my only aim is to have it finalized fairly and reasonably. I am taking what was said on record by my estranged husband very seriously and my legal team is taking steps to address those allegations through the process afforded to us by the law. For now, this is as much as I am comfortable with saying. To address all these issues, please allow us the space and privacy to deal with what should be a very private matter. Thank you for uh, taking the time to read this. Sister Mizim Shongo.
just uh, to be honest it is really sad when uh, relationships that uh, most people look up to and envy comes to public eye as something that is totally opposite of what they have uh, been envisioning and especially when it comes to celebrity life we all or rather most of us envy the celebrity life but then uh, we don't know what really happens behind the closed doors and at this stage we don't really know who is telling the truth and who is not because uh, like also means he has not really admitted to all the allegations he says Guti, there was once upon a time an altercation that happened and at that instant he had to defend himself and both of them uh, where there was a physical hurt by each other so now i'm not saying Guti, i believe umohale and i'm not saying i believe usomizi because honestly as much as we can comment on this we can really never know what really transpired so only two of them knows what happened on that day and like not just on that day but prior it, it can be prior to that day or just after that day and like really we just don't know we just hear what both of them are saying and the only person who can tell the truth is themselves and for us to know what so is for them to say okay i agree on this one and i agree on this one and yes this is true and this is true if ever there is anything true and for the other party to say yes this did happen and uh, this one two three did happen and like really maybe i have taken this to an extra level or perhaps i still remained on my remain on my truth and the other party coming through and saying yes this indeed is the truth see now we just spectators into their relationship and to the end of it sadly so remember you can go ahead and comment down below in the comment section if you have anything to comment and remember to keep your comments respectful because we are all adults in the end of the day thank you so much for watching this video and from me to you don't forget to like the video share us the video and subscribe if you have not yet done so and turn on that notification bell i'm loving you see you soon on my next video upload Mwah.